Let's deal with the first one, which is the speed. So let's say, for example, you're a premium IP Vanish user. You made a connection to a server in London or your local location. You now start your favorite speed test application, this one here. Let's give that a second and let's see using a premium VPN what kind of speeds I can get. Now we can see in this example on my third generation Fire TV Cube, IP Vanish is giving me, I would say, just under, okay, just over 100 meg downstream, which in most cases you can see is even fine for 4K gaming, 4K uh, streaming playback. But you're thinking, why is it only 100 meg where you've actually got a much faster internet speed? Let's do that test one more time before we make any changes. And we can see on test number two, using IP Vanish on a London based server, downstream we're pulling give or take about 80 meg, uh, 89 meg on the second test, which again I said is sufficient for you know streaming, but if you're looking for faster speeds, what can you do? In most cases, people just download IP Vanish, they create an account, they log in, they don't really look at any of the settings. Now, one of the main settings you can change to affect the speed of your VPN connection is to look at which protocol you're using for that connection. Now, the latest version of IP Vanish, they're actually using one of the new protocols called WireGuard. Now, if I go over to the settings, we can see here, by default, this is using OpenVPN. If I click on that, Let's now select the top protocol, which is WireGuard. So not only is this one of the fastest protocols, it also has some benefits and enhancements for security. So really for maximum speed, for maximum security, this is the one I would recommend if it works for your particular use case. Of course, if you do this protocol and you find that your speed goes down or goes worse, then I wouldn't bother changing it. But because you're on my device, I've now made the change to WireGuard. Let's go back. Let's now disconnect. So it applies the change. Let's connect back in. Give that a second. We're now connected using WireGuard. Let's now try that speed test again. Let's see if we can get anything better than 100 meg. Let's open that up. Okay, so testing again using WireGuard. Can we see anything better than 100 meg? And there we have it guys. So literally making one quick change we're now getting three times the speed that we were getting before on IP Vanish. So you can see maybe with the first speed test, somebody may be frustrated that why do I normally have three, 400 meg downstream for my applications using IP Vanish? Why am I only seeing 100 meg? Well, double checking your settings, making sure you're using the right protocol, you can see will really help you with that particular issue. Let's test that again, just to make sure it wasn't a fluke or a one-off but we can see on my device, my third generation Phi TV Cube using IP Vanish on the WireGuard protocol. Again, we are consistently pushing more than 300 meg downstreams. Okay, that's really the first reason why somebody may want to avoid IP Vanish is the speed. But as you can see with the right setup, you can easily fix that issue. Now here's the biggest one or the most common one where I need a virtual IP address from a location Let's say I'm trying to access a USA based application, maybe 2B TV, maybe Redbox TV. I've opened up IP Vanish. I've made a connection to New York. Let's click on connect. I've made a connection. I've got that New York based IP address, USA IP address. Let's go back. You open up your favorite streaming application. And what happens? it tells you that we are unable to load this page. So even though I've got a USA IP address, my favorite streaming application is not working. And you can see why initially this would cause you frustration because you thought you've paid for a premium VPN. It's supposed to give you that IP address from different locations. Why is it even though I have that virtual IP address from the correct location, this application is not working? Well, an example of this, the most common issue is that these applications, especially some of the larger ones, they do tend to blacklist certain IP addresses from certain locations. If you do find that your application is not working, all you have to do is go out of this. Let's go back into IP Vanish. Let's now try a different location, but still inside USA. Let's go to locations. 
And let's say, for example, let's try Cincinnati. Press the select button on that. Click on that. So both are in USA, but this is just a different state in the same country. That's now connected. Let's now go back. So once again, I have a new IP address. Let's open up Redbox and let's see what we see. Give that a second and we are now fully unlocked this application. So this is shows you guys that even if you do get an error message on your favorite streaming application, it doesn't necessarily mean it's the fault of the VPN, simply just changing the state in the VPN or maybe choosing another server in that state normally allows you to get around these particular problems. And we can see I can now access all this application no error messages, no problems. And then we have the price. Well, right now, just in the month of August, there really is a super special deal where you can get that total protection for all of your devices. Doesn't matter if you have five Fire Sticks or 10 Android TVs or 15 laptops, all of your devices can be covered with a single license giving you that total protection, allowing you to change your IP address, allowing you to access all of your favorite geolocked applications. You can ensure your ISP can't track you, all of these advertisers, all of these other companies can't monitor what you're doing to get that total peace of mind for under $3 a month. I think this special offer is definitely worthwhile checking out, especially because they give you that 30 day no quibble money back guarantee. So you really can give it a go. If it doesn't work for you, you can get all of your money back. It does help support the channel. So many thanks if you want to do that. Do have a look in the video description and pinned comment for this special link. Do leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think and I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.